Hey ho, are ya? Hey ho, are ya? Hey guys, this is Chief Landless bringing you guys part two of this demolition gameplay. If you haven't watched part one, I suggest you click the annotation at the top left of your screen, and that will take you to five minutes of your life you won't get back. <laughs> I'm kidding, it's more of a ramble uh, commentary, but if you want to watch it, click the annotation at the top left. But, anyways, hopefully, I talk about something informative in this one. Um. And I hope you guys enjoy the gameplay while we're waiting. And uh, I just got a text, and I should probably <laughs> turn my ringtone off. <laughs> that happens. Oh, I'm supposed to go have lunch with a friend soon, so hopefully I don't rush this here. Um, I'll answer in a bit. But, anyways, I've uh, if you haven't noticed yet, I have started to put a little bit more structure to my channel, and I thought I'd bring up. A, uh, what, what kind of got me into gaming in the first place, which was the uh, the Halo series, and in, in specific, um, specifically, sorry, Halo, uh, the first Halo. I, uh, I had it as a little kid uh, for the PC, and I uh, just found that disc a few days ago and decided, why not do a live commentary session of me playing through the campaign, and um, I'll be doing that ten minutes at a time as a uh, it's kind of hard to keep everyone's attention for more than 10 minutes, and I'll be uploading that uh, series every Tuesday. And um, yes, that's uh, that's pretty much it for that. Um, gonna stick to uh, doing prepared Black Ops commentaries like this one every Friday. If I do miss any of these dates, please understand I do have a life. Things do come up, and um, I will apologize when I when I do put up a video afterwards explaining why I may have not have been there that, for that particular day and I'll apologize in advance if I don't but anyways um geez now I got the text on my mind <laughs> um what was I gonna say now I had a bunch of stuff to talk oh yes um I thought for the um my next Black Ops commentary, the, a prepared one, um, I thought I'd uh, make it a little bit more personal and uh, s start kind of like a story time series, but not uh, a full-on story time series because I am 19. Not, I'm, I've barely through part of my life. There's obviously not too many great life lessons or stories in my life as I'm still living them. But if you want to hear more of those, I'm, I'm all... I'm game for it. Uh, I don't know. Give me suggestions in the comments. What do you want to hear me talk about? My first this, my first that. Have you ever? And yada yada yada. I could always try doing that for commentaries. But um, I have a really meaningful story. That's well. Everyone has that one day in their life that they'll never forget. It's you'll it'll stick in your head for the rest of your life. And it's not just like a regular story, but it's one of those stories that you remember in extreme detail. And it's been, what is it? It's been 10 years and I still remember it as if it was yesterday. And um, I'm not gonna tell you guys the story now, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna save it for another day to uh, Try to actually, you know, do the story justice because it's very meaningful to me. Um, just even thinking about it brings up deep emotions that are, you know, near and dear to me. But again, that's for another time. And um, that's enough for talking about my channel and what I plan to do. And um, let's get back to the gameplay here, as if I haven't touched on it <laughs> at all, even in part one. <laughs> Um, over the course of uh, the period since I've uploaded part one and going to upload this part two here, I've been using the FAMAS a lot. And um, be to be honest, I thought it was amazing for a little while now, but I took maybe about, oh, as I said, about a three week break because this footage was recorded a while ago. So um, I took a three week break and I came back. And I don't know what the hell's wrong with me, but to me it seems like the FAMAS has killer recoil for some god knows reason, and I just can't seem to use it anymore. I don't know what it is, it's 
probably because I haven't played in a while, but I did play last night, and I just, I was frustrated. So, um, I started playing around with my classes, and I decided, you know what, I haven't touched on the uh, SMG classes in a little while, and there's a few guns that I have never even really used, let alone picked up during a game, because I just rarely see them. And that was the, uh, Mac 11, and oh my goodness, if you have never tried it, it is pretty powerful, and um, I definitely say it is underrated. The one downside of it, um, with uh, just no extended mags or stuff like that, um, you can only pretty much kill one person, maybe two if they're not hugging each other, but um, and then there's extended mags, and you can get maybe three or four, but... The one downside I find is um, you always need one extra bullet. But other than that, I'm I've actually it was surprised me, and um, I've been using using it a lot more, trying to figure out which attachments could uh, make it better, what could help work with this, and um, yeah, I'm currently um, working on that, and I'm even gone uh, gone over the fact of uh, not using a silencer on it just to try it out and a uh, trial lightweight. <laughs> Sorry, this last little kill there still makes me laugh and it's been about a week or so since I've seen it. Such a funny uh, round ending kill cam. My All my friends were like, what the hell is going on? <laughs> oh my goodness. Anyway, so yes, the Mac 11 has definitely um surpassed my expectations. Um, I've kind of come down to the stage in Black Ops now where I don't know if it's the connection that's um, provoking this, but I've I'm starting to um, hate Black Ops not like not like full on, but like I know the relation is love love hate relationship between this game, but right now I'm in a period of hate. Could just be my connection issues, but um, not having the, the greatest amount of fun. Yes, the greatest amount of fun, the most amount of fun. And um, so I've been playing other games a lot with my friends. We've actually gone back to Halo Reach a few times here. I've started Halo on the PC, like I said. Got my puppies again, and um, I've been digging through my uh, drawer, uh, looking through all the old games that I haven't touched in a while, and. Just playing those and um, having a lot of fun, just for fun now. I'm, I, I don't care anymore. Um, I'm at the point where my kill death ratio in Black Ops kind of doesn't mean anything. I did work up to the 2.0, which I set that as a goal for myself a while back because I was originally at uh, 2.7 when I first started Black Ops and then bunch of dicking around ensued and I dropped down to like 1.2 over the course of a week of dicking around and I was like ho oh, ho ho hold on here alright time to get serious here and um it was by then I already I was already like third or fourth prestige and I, it, my kill death ratio plummeted without me noticing and it took a great deal of effort to get it back up to 2.0 because as you the longer you play the um, the the harder it is for your kill death ratio to go up and down. And uh, it proved difficult, but I didn't reach that goal. And now it's just a period of let's have fun, Black Ops. A bunch of games are going to be coming out soon. Modern Warfare 3 is expected uh, later this year. And um, I don't know. I might look forward to that. Might buy it. I probably will buy it. It's a Call of Duty game. We won't. But anyways, Black Ops has got a map pack coming up pretty soon. I'll probably get that instead. Uh, looking forward to it, as always. Countless hours, playing zombies. Anyways, guys, the game is wrapping up. We win this demolition game by a, by, blah, 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 by a manslaughter. <laughs> I'm Elmer Fudd, baby, baby. That's not even really Elmer Fudd. Anyways, guys, I go 111 and 18. I get three dogs and countless other um, killstreaks. Thanks for watching, guys. This is Chief Lance signing out. Peace.